Oh, good, you're here. Lately, Batman, I've been pondering the value of human life and your strange insistence upon preserving even its basest forms. Take the barely literate triple murderer in the nearby riot. He's a dead man come dawn. When the microbomb I surreptitiously placed in his brain explodes. My hypothesis is simple. When faced with the task of trying to save one condemned man amongst that gaggle of idiots, even you will give up in despair. Oh, and don't knock him out. Knock, knock, knock. What little brain activity he has keeps that cranial combustible from detonating. Combustible. Detonating. I need to use the remote batarang to scan the nearby crowd for Riddler's victim. There he is. The remote batarang can carry an electric charge. It should defuse Riddler's microbomb without causing a detonation. Well, congratulations, hero. You saved a murderer, a monster, a moron. The gene pool thanks you for your efforts. There's more doomed men in Gotham tonight. You won't prove your obnoxiously principal point until you save them all. Until, until, until you save them all. Detective, oh, come on. we both know you have more important things to do than save a rioting recidivist with a bomb in his brain. More more important. You're just sparing him a sudden violent death to spite me, aren't you? Me. There he is. Ha! This proves nothing. Nothing. Not until you save them all. Save them, them, them. this works batman there's a rioter with a bomb in his brain all you have to do is not save him to do and the world will be a slightly better place come dawn come dawn those thugs won't let me near i should use the remote batarang to scan for riddler's victim I don't 
don't understand. No, no, no. I offer you the deaths of these marauding monsters, and you go out of your way to save them. Why? Yeah. Ethics over logic, Batman. It'll be your downfall. Lock, lock, downfall.